Today, some incredible cheesy jacket potatoes. So guys, let's do it. The first step for this unbelievable recipe, you wanna preheat your oven to 180 degrees. And then you want some nice big baking potatoes. Give them a little prick with a fork, stick them onto a baking tray or in a baking dish. Add a little drizzle of olive oil, rub the olive oil over the potatoes. And then you wanna pop them in the oven and bake these off for about 45, 50 minutes. While the potatoes are in, we wanna fry off some bacon to crispy perfection. So take some lovely streaky bacon, lay that in the pan, and you want to cook off the bacon until it's really nice and crispy. Add a little splash of water every few minutes. If you want to know why, I'm linking a video down below showing you all about cooking bacon with water. It basically beautifully renders out the fat and gets the bacon really nice and crispy. Once the bacon is done, get that out of the pan, stick it onto a chopping board, and you want to chop it up really nice and fine, about the consistency of breadcrumbs. Stick your bacon to one side, and after about 50 minutes, the bacon potatoes will be ready. So get those out of the oven. You want to get yourself a nice large mixing bowl and start by cutting a square out of the top of the baked potato. Remove the top and once you've done this with all of the potatoes you want to use a spoon to scrape out all of the fluffy potato inside. So hollow out the potato skins and then we want some Dijon mustard. Add a flat tablespoon of the Dijon and then some creme fraiche. Add a heaped teaspoon of the creme fraiche and then chuck in a nice load of that bacon. Then some extra mature cheddar cheese. Grate in a really nice handful and the last ingredient we want some parmesan so grate in the same amount of parmesan as you have cheddar then you want to season with some salt and pepper and give the filling a really good mashing up once you've mashed up your filling you want to take the potato skins and fill them with the beautiful bacony cheesy mixture so stuff the potato skins with that lovely filling and when you're done you want to pop them back in the oven and bake these off for another 20 minutes or so all the cheese will melt and you'll get a beautiful gooey bacony cheesy filling these things are insane while the jackets are baking off you want to take yourself some chives and simply dice up the chives really nice and fine stick them into a bowl pop them to one side ready to garnish the jackets which at this point should be about done so after 20 minutes get them out of the oven pop them onto a plate leave them five minutes before you tuck in they'll be screaming hot grate over a touch of parmesan sprinkle over some of that bacon and then finish with a good pinch of the chives. And there we have an amazing indulgent treat, jacket potatoes on a whole new level. So get stuck in and I'll see you next time.